Hi guys, this is Brad Lincoln from Pathway to Oz, and today I'm going to discuss with you some of the engineering programs that are available to international students within Australia. Now, there are many, many different fields of engineering um, and different streams, and even one standalone bachelor could have four or five different offshoots on what qualification you'll actually obtain at the end, depending on the electives you've selected. But I'm gonna run through some of our most popular options for international students, so you can get your head around what's available in the engineering field to international students in Australia. Okay, so first up we have the civil engineering drafts person. Now this program is usually delivered at a vocational level, and one school actually does it as an associate degree level. But this is really probably one of our most popular programs for an entry level engineering course and also creates a very solid pathway to future visas in Australia on completion of your studies. Now, drafting, you mean you're essentially going to be assisting with the design and helping the, the main engineers on a project with, the, of course, the strong focus on the civil engineering elements, so your roads, your drainage. Um, all that sort of stuff, okay? So this is a really cool program. It's starting from around $10,000 per year, is available Australia-wide, and has a duration of two years. Next up, we have the Advanced Diploma of Electrical Engineering. Again, another really cool entry-level engineering course that does make you eligible for the 485 visa and can sort of generate a pathway to some more permanent visas in Australia as well. Now, this course is a very similar vein to the Civil Engineering Drafts person, okay? But of course, with the electrical, you've got a very strong focus on the electrical side of things. So the planning and placement of cabling and how much power a building or a construction project is actually gonna require, um, all those sorts of things. So if you're sort of more interested in the electrical side of things than the civil, I mean, a really great option to look at. Now this course is starting from around $14,000 per year. Currently is only available in Brisbane. Um, that could change in the future, but you've only got one location for this course at the moment, and the duration is two years. Okay, another one we've seen that's really gained in traction and popularity um, over the last, say, three to four years. It was a course that was only available in one location, is now available absolutely everywhere, and that is the Advanced Diploma of Telecommunications Network Engineering. Now, the telecommunications, internet, phone lines, you mean, everything that these days modern society runs off, this is what you'd be looking after. And not only that, but you mean, think about when an office building's being built and you've got a big office, a big company, sorry, moving into that office area, they're gonna need the networking set up. They're gonna need all their computers set up to run everything integrated together. So, you mean, this is where a lot of your work and focus is gonna go, um, but an extremely high demand profession and some really great options for the course as well. So the course is starting from only around $8,000 per year, is available Australia-wide and has a duration of two years. Okay, next up we have the Bachelor of Engineering. Okay, now this is obviously one of your premier programs within the engineering field. Um, your bachelor level qualifications, you're gonna be at university and the universities in Australia that offer this program are by far some of the most renowned in the world, okay? Um, the graduates that are coming out of places like UQ and Griffith and things like that are literally industry leaders by the time they come out. You know what I mean? It's absolutely crazy the focus these universities have on the engineering sector. The really cool thing about engineering, as I said at the start, there's so many different variants and variations you can go in, whether it be environmental engineering, structural engineering, design, automotive engineering. You mean, your possibilities are literally endless. Once you figure out what your passion is, you can generally find an engineering stream that will complement that so, so well. Okay, now the cost of these courses are definitely going up from the previous. They do start from around $25,000 to $30,000 per year. They are available Australia-wide and generally has a duration of four years. And finally, guys, we're gonna be having a look at the Masters of Engineering Management. Okay, so for me, I think this is a really great program for someone who's maybe gone out in that, done their Bachelor of Engineering, they've built up some life and work experience and wanting to take that next step. 
the Master of Engineering Management is literally perfect for you because it's gonna give you the skills you need to not just focus in and develop your skills, but running a whole team of engineers for major projects, whether it be in Australia or around the world. Um, now, this course for a master's in engineering is really quite affordable, affordable in my opinion. It's starting from around 25 grand per year. Um, it's available Australia-wide and has a duration of only two years. So a really, really cool option for someone to take that next step in their career. So guys, I hope you found this information helpful. Please note, all the courses I mentioned today are eligible for the 485 graduate visa. So if you do have any questions about these programs or any other programs that you may be interested in, never hesitate to contact the team at Pathway to Oz. Thanks.